What's going on guys? Well, it's your boy Panda and welcome back to a another video in this channel. Now today is going to be a different video from usual. Instead of experiments, I will teach you how to make a redstone clock. These are the two redstone clocks that I know of or uh, I don't know. These are the two of I know of and maybe you could leave me down in the comments if you have any more ideas. So the first one is more cheaper than the second one. So all you need is to do this. You make a T shape like this and destroy the middle block. Now you could put your lever either here, 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 or here. It doesn't depend, but as long as you put lever in either this block or this block, depending on which way you would like to um, put it. So I forgot one thing. So for the first one, you put a redstone torch here. Put a redstone repeater right there. And put a redstone dust there. That should create my the more simpler redstone clock. So here's my other here's the other redstone clock that I know. All you need to do is place one block here, put a redstone torch there, redstone torch there, put a redstone right there. Now place it like this, and you have yourself a redstone clock. So this, you, know, you don't want to put them really close to each other, because if you have an Android like mine, it's going to be pretty slow. So it works as just fine. Um, I'm pretty sure you can turn it off by doing this. There we go. And for, you're, you're probably asking, what do we do with these? So, we could make it into a, maybe a trident farm. I'll teach you how to make a trident farm or a trident killer later. Um, Okay, anyways, thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you learned something today on how to make a redstone clock. And goodbye.